examples of identifying position. Part 2 Children, in the previous video we saw some interesting examples related to the position of objects using terms such as on, under, inside, outside. In this video, we will see some more examples related to the position of objects. Today, Chotu and Pinky are helping their mother in cleaning the house. Chotu, look here. Your math notebook is kept on the table. Keep it under the table. Chotu picked up his math notebook from the table and kept it under the table. Mummy, Choto's pencil box is also kept outside his bag. Choto, keep this pencil box inside your bag. And Choto kept his pencil box inside his bag. After keeping the pencil box inside the bag, he left his bag on the bed. Choto, please pick your bag from the bed and keep it in the Almira. Okay, mummy. Choto picked up his bag from the bed and kept it inside the Almira. After cleaning that room, they went to the next room to clean it. And they found toys of Choto and Pinky lying scattered all over the floor. So their mother fetched their toy box from the top of the Almira and said, Children, now you both collect all your toys and keep them inside this box. Choto and Pinky kept all their toys in the box and cleaned the entire room. And then both of them went out to play. So children, did you see how Pinky and Choto changed the position of different objects while cleaning the rooms, like picking up the notebook from the table and placing it under the table. And the toy box was on the top of the Almira. Choto's mother took the box from there and kept it down. Even Choto and Pinky picked all the toys which were lying outside the box and kept them inside the box. So children, that was all for today. In this video, we saw some more interesting examples related to the position of objects like on, under, inside, outside. And I hope you all must have understood this properly. Bye children!